welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another affordable shoe unboxing so today we are going to be unboxing and styling the in retro se in the black colorway so if you're new to my channel make sure to like comment and subscribe turn on those post notifications because i do so many videos just like this i also have a playlist dedicated to all my shoe reviews unboxing stylings and whatnot so definitely go check it out because i have so many jordans so many yeezys all the shoes girl i got it all so if you're looking for some shoes for the low definitely go check out this playlist so let's just get into the video so today these shoes are sent to me by p shoes thank you guys so much for sending me these air jordan retro fours in the black colorway i'm super excited for these shoes because i just love this colorway i think that it's so cute and super wearable thank you to p shoes i will leave all their information in the description box as well as a discount code on the screen if i have one always go check the description box because i always have a code for you guys or some sort of discount in there the shoes here is the shoe box it's just a matte black with the flight in air jordan symbol and then still matte back at the bottom but with some speckles and then we have the information card at the front so <laughs> So I got mine in a size seven. Usually I'm a size eight and a half woman. So you guys can kind of reference from that. So for this pair of shoes that I got from Pea Shoes, I got a size seven and they fit perfectly. I've worn them out already a few times. I really love them. They fit like any other pair of retros. They are like snug around the ankle. So I do recommend a half size up. Said that's with any retro fours. They are pretty hard to get on without relacing up everything. So ooh, are we slanted? I think we are. Okay, there we go. I think that's better. Here's what they look like on the inside. The shoes had stuffing and it also came with this red tag on the shoes. Mine came off because I was playing around with it. Um, I honestly didn't really want this on to be honest because I feel like this tag is a little bit obnoxious at times so I'm kind of happy that it's off but it is detachable really easy to take off so these retro fours are just very simple matte black black on black um there's really no difference of color besides the bottom of the shoes which has the air jordan symbol in white it's a completely black sole other than that it has black netting black laces all of that on the tongue of the shoe it has the air jordan symbol and flight and then on the inside it has a black on black air jordan upside down well as the shoe size detailing on the inside and then the air jordan symbol on the inside these shoes are so simple but like just so sleek and sexy to me everybody needs a good pair of black sneakers in their closet and i definitely think that these are a little bit more expensive um and a better upgrade from like your regular air force ones or hirachis because i was really into hirachis in high school but I'm definitely going to be throwing my Hirachis away because these are great replacements. Alright, so with that being said, we are going to get into the next portion of the video where I style the shoes for you guys and show you guys the shoes on foot a little bit. But I would definitely be doing a lot of black on black looks with that, I know for sure, um, with these shoes because, I mean, I'm basic and that's the easiest thing to go for. But once again, these shoes are really, really easy to style because they're so simple and just plain black. But let's just see what type of outfits we can come up with with these shoes. Let's get into the next part of the video. Sister, brother, son, daughter, father, motherfucker, copper, got the Maserati dancing on a bridge, pussy popping, tell the coppers, ha 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 ha, you can't catch them, you can't stop them, I go by them goon rules, if you can't beat them, then 
you pop them. You can't man them, then you mop them. You can't stand them, then you drop them. You pop them, cause we pop them like over Red and Baca. Motherfucker, I'm ill. Yeah. A million here, a million there. Okay, so here is the first outfit that I decided to wear. Um, I did show this in a lovely wholesale haul, not the full thing together, but if you guys follow me on Instagram, then you guys would have already seen this outfit that I put together in my little reels. The top is from Lovely Wholesale. The pants are from Shein. I'm always wearing these full leather leggings. They're super easy to style. And then I have on this bubble, this bubble material type of bag. And then of course the cat fours. And I really like this outfit and how it looks together. I might have to get an Instagram picture in this soon. I love how this top just like levels up the outfit. It doesn't make it look too chill, but at the same time, it's like, you really threw something on, you know? Like this is just a sweater, some leggings, and some sneakers, but it looks very like put together still at the same time i actually might wear this very soon yeah that is it for outfit number one get on to outfit number two I don't owe you like two vowels, but I would like for you to pay me by the hour. <laughs> and I'd rather be pushing flowers than to be in the pen sharing showers. Tony told us this world was ours, and the Bible told us every girl was sour. Don't play in a garden and don't smell my flower. Call me Mr. Carter, Mr. Lawn Mower. Boy, I got so many bitches like I'm Michael Lowry. Even when stuff on this, she couldn't die with me. Okay, so here is the second outfit. I really do try to stare away from like really, really tight glows because I just don't really love that look for me to be honest. Um, so I end up dressing like a little boy <laughs> with my cargo pants. So I'm really trying to like push myself to wear something a little bit more girly for the other girls that are watching me that like tight form fitted stuff and though they are sneakers and they're more a little bit masculine they still can grow with a girly feminine outfit and you can still make it cute and comfortable i'm wearing a jean jacket this is from probably urban planet i got this such a long time ago urban planet is a canadian company it's this like green bodysuit and it cuts off like right here that's why i have the jacket over it to cover up my bra straps and my shoulders because you know obviously it's colder outside and i want to just wear it like this outside even if it wasn't cold outside i would definitely be wearing my jean jacket as well as this shein um replica kind of part of that is it for this outfit and for this video to p shoes thank you guys so much for sending me these shoes um all the information once again is going to be in the description box make sure to like comment and subscribe turn on those post notifications since i'm always feel free to dm me whatever whatever and i will see you guys in the next video review vlog whatever it is i'll see you guys okay,